keep a couple of things in mind. One is, in January, Massachusetts was the bellwether of America. We're the ones that set this whole national torrent loose. And it's unclear whether we caused it or whether we predicted it. It's probably somewhere in between, probably more predictive than causal. But, you know, it, it's amazing. All of America is kind of finishing what we started here with the election of Scott Brown and the special election to replace Ted Kennedy. So we do it everywhere but here. So now nine months, 10 months later, we're back here in Massachusetts. Uh, uh, the electorate is considered a little bit volatile here. We went into uh, uh, today's campaign unsure whether uh, Charlie Baker would win, whether Deval Patrick would win. It was considered a toss up race nationally. And in the end, um, a couple of things happened. One, uh, Deval Patrick had pretty wide appeal among a huge swath of the electorate. He's considered a nice guy. People understood Massachusetts didn't fare as bad as California, New York, and the Great Recession. Charlie Baker did come in with all these built-in advantages. Number one, he had this extraordinary resume. He served in two of the toughest jobs in state government. He led the turnaround of Harvard Pilgrim uh, Health Care, uh, which was a huge deal here in Massachusetts. He is telegenic. He is intelligent. And more than anything else, this was a year when incumbents, especially incumbent governors, faced with this god-awful economy were in a whole world of trouble. Charlie Baker had all of that to take advantage of. And the truth is, he ran from this generic Republican playbook that might work in some other state, but here in Massachusetts just didn't, uh, didn't fly. Charlie Baker tried to be the angry man here. And it was a time when the voters weren't really angry, they were fearful. Charlie Baker tried blaming Deval Patrick for every single thing that had gone wrong in the national economy. Massachusetts voters are very, very intelligent people. And they understood that Deval Patrick might have a whole lot of shortcomings, but he didn't cause this, this awful national t economy.